Billy Wiz Gamer back online and we're doing the marquee matchups for this week. We actually get a rare players pack, which are 50k plus pack. But for to do as usual, I'm gonna start off with the Guangzhou R and F versus Guangzhou. Basically, this is a team that costs around about 2,800, requires no loyalty and no position changes whatsoever. Uh, so let's crack on. I'll tell you afterwards if these players are expensive, how to do it. You'll, you'll see, basically. In goal, we've got Sun Li, bought for 200, plays for Shanghai in the Chinese first league and is Chinese. The right back is Song Long, bought for 200, plays for Shandong Longning in the Chinese first league and is from China. The centre back on the right is Jing Jiang Yang, bought for 200, plays for Haibi CFFC. Chinese first league and is from China. The centre back on the left is Yang Boyo. Well, for 200, paid for Jiang Su Sunny, the Chinese first league and is Chinese. The left back is a right back, is Jiang Zi. Bought for 200, paid for Chong Queen SWM in the Chinese first league and is from China. The right midfielder is Juan Camilo Salazar, for 200, plays for San Lorenzo in the Argentinian first league and is from Colombia. The central midfielder on the right is a CAM, it's Andres Felipe Roa, for 400, plays for Huracan in the Argentinian first league and is from Colombia. The centre forward is a centre attacking midfielder, it's Gervaso Nunes, for 400, plays for Atletico Tucumán in the Argentinian first league and is from Argentina. The centre mid on the left is a CAM, it's Augustin Bouzat, for 400, plays for Villez Sarsfield in the Argentinian first league and is from Argentina. The left midfielder is Horacio Tijanovic, bought for 200, plays for Gymnasia in the Argentinian first league and is Argentinian. And then the final guy, the striker up front, is Augustin Fontana, bought for 200. <clears throat> and what I did basically, guys, Augusto bought for 200, plays for Banfield in the Argentinian first league. And it's Argentinian. But what I did basically kept the back four and the goalkeeper from the Chinese league, the, the centre backs, and then two right backs because the left backs were more expensive. And they were all 200 anyway, so it's just easy, isn't it? You know, you can't get cheaper than a 200 player. So uh, you have to do more than two nationalities and get the rare players. And the rare players in the Chinese league were expensive, so we went to the Argentinian league, put the search up to 400 maximum, buy it now price, and then you saw there'll, there'll be just these silvers or bronze rares that you can buy for 400. They haven't got to be anything special, just people from that league. If you can get a nationality link, then it will be good. But if you can't, it'll probably be good. I mean, our chemistry is 80, 95 and it's 85, so you should be hungry, dory And then once I've got the three rare players from the Argentinian league, I just filled it in with other Argentinian league players and it all worked out hunky dory So I'm just saying that. So if these players per name are really expensive, just use somebody in the same league of the same nationality and the link will be exactly the same. That's that's what I'm trying to get at. So let's submit, actually have a look and see what we get in this small prime gold players pack. Come on, come on, FIFA gods, give me some finesse. Well, it's not a walkout. Come on, give me some boards. It's got no boards. Her dad, her dad, at 77 rated. He's my best player. Out of the pack. Awesome. And he's a duplicate. Well, thank you for watching. Please subscribe for more. Billy Wiz Gamer over. Oh, there's a link in the description for a chance to win FIFA 20. Billy Wiz Gamer over. And it's